Hello friends, welcome to our channel Cloud Tested Solutions. So today we will see in this video how we can do the multiple RDP of the instance. Okay, so we have created one Windows Server 2012, uh, sorry 16 we have created that 2016 on this on AWS server. We can take 2012, 19, 16, anyone we can do that. Okay, so how we can do it? like the terminal server. Okay. Suppose by default we can take the session, two sessions we can take using this IP address. Okay, so we can take the RDP by default two, but if we want multiple RDP, so we can take for 120 days. Okay, that 120 days is free. Okay, for 120 days we can see, suppose we want 10 user RDP, 10 sessions like this. Okay, so we can take that you after installing that the RDP service in this in the future of the server manager okay so we will start here but before starting you also subscribe our channel also so suppose afterwards we have suppose we can say that the new videos will be there also coming so you will get the notification also so jab naya video hum log jab banayenge to aapko bhi notification mil jayega so subscribe our channel also so let's see we can start here so multiple rdp ke liye hum log yahan pe server manager mein jana padega so click on the windows server manager click on the server manager so we need to install the two feature i will show you and after that clicking on the server manager we need to click on the add role and feature this one so after that we need to click on the add roles and feature okay so i have just created this ec2 instance so that's why it takes a little bit time but it will open that so yeah it's opened then next click on the next again click on the next again click on the next so after clicking on the next we need to select after this tab remote desktop service okay so here we can see here the remote desktop services so we need to select this one and click on the next after click on the next next and here we need to select two feature licensing remote desktop licensing first then next one is a session session host add feature click on the next and after that install this one okay so this we are doing this 120 days free okay after that we can purchase like the license also but this 120 days we can use okay and this suppose we have suppose in office 10 users and then they want this uh, terminal server rdp or they want the session of this server okay by default we can take two but after this installing it will available for we can say that 30 users 40 users it's unlimited like so as per the we can say that the ram and cpu of the user you uh, we can say that the usage of the server it depends upon how we can take the users rdp so after installing this installation is started okay so after installation completed we need to restart once okay it will say to restart this server so this installation is started meanwhile we can create here the more two more users click on the tools and click on the computer management and we can create here the two users meanwhile it's, it's installing so go to the local users here is the user tab click on the double click user then right click and then new user test one giving the password here the same password i'm copying and pasting like and then 
we need to create first user first user i have created second user i am creating then here we need to create and we can give here the administrator access for both the users click right click and properties member of administrator click on add click on advance click on find now and click on add administrator select the administrator and ok click on apply and ok then test to right click properties same as it is member of administrator advance find now administrator ok apply and ok ok so these two users we have created and we can see here you must restart the destination server that this is our the destination server so i am restarting this one continue and it's restarting after restarting we need to also activate there the remote desktop service okay so how we can do that that we'll see uh, this also so this is very useful like the when the use our users are out of the office or they are doing the work from home so this we can use also okay if our users are connecting from the office that the our cloud server so you can you can you use so for this this is present or this validate this feature for 120 days we can see uh, so we can take here the rdp let's see it's coming uh, yeah so this is over the ip address of the server then taking the access yeah it's initializing yeah okay so password is here and then copy and paste yeah click on the yes yes okay So server is open and we can see here after that uh, open that we need to click on the windows button okay so we need to go to the tools and activate that the remote desktop service also and after we can see here in the right hand side the notification will come after some time or one to two minute that 120 days it's showing here that our service of the rdp or the rds like that the remote desktop service license is validate for 120 days so we can see here we can see here we can see notification here in the right hand side that it will be validated for 120 days okay so meanwhile yeah let's see here remote desktop service will stop working in 120 days okay so ye 120 days ka jo period hai usme hum log yahan pe use kar sakte hain so click on the windows abhi yahan pe hum log ko next step karte hain ki usko start karte hain activate karte hain so after that click on the tools here we can see remote desktop service go to the license manager here is not activated that we need to activate click on the activate server click on the next click on the next here you need to give your name first name last name and company name and here your country click on the next here we need to fill up our the email unit company address city uh, i am trying as a blah i am clicking on the next directly so we need to fill up that one also and then we need to click on the next and click on the next again 
and then we need to click on the cancel see it's activated okay so let's try for from our two users because this administrator is the first one let's try from test one that we have created test one yeah okay so we can try with the first user ever we have created तो यहाँ पे अभी हम लोग टेस्ट कर रहे हैं कि टेस्ट वन से हम लोग यहाँ पे अभी चेक कर रहे हैं आर डी पी यहाँ पे हम लोगों को मिलना चाहिए यस ओके इट्स गेटिंग तो यहाँ पे हम लोग ये मिल रहा है टेस्ट वन से सो वी आर नाउ चेकिंग विद द टेस्ट टू तो यहाँ पे अभी हम लोग चेक कर रहे हैं कि टेस्ट टू से मिल रहा है क्या ओके सो टेस्ट टू सो वी आर ट्राइंग नाउ दिद द टेस्ट टू okay so here we'll yeah so it's also getting the test two is also getting that means we can able to see here then now i have logged in the three users you have many users you can log in so many sessions we can take here using this feature i hope you understand this video so we can see here like three rdps are running here this is administrator this is a test one this is a test two okay so we can see here the test two is here the name here okay so i hope you understand this concept thank you so much for watching the video and we'll see in the next video and subscribe also our channel also thank you so much